since the dawn of the age of information. It feels as if humanity has been at a constant rate of breakthroughs and discoveries since the beginning of the 21st century. Every year researchers are making incredible discoveries. However, one thing that continues to baffle them is the human brain. Going back a few years ago, Australian researchers said they were going to grow a brain cell on a computer chip. The team was able to create an environment which allowed them to monitor how the cells grew and connected. The idea here was for the scientists to be able to study their connectivity. Research scientists have struggled for years to recreate neurocircuitry in the lab. One of the researchers said the following, Understanding how neurocircuits form in the brain is one of the fundamental questions in neuroscience. Those connections form the basis for how we process information, and understanding them is the key to developing treatments for mental disorders. It's early days but researchers are hoping these studies will give them an in-depth insight into how our brain functions. Recently, we discussed the possibility of scientific groups soon emerging with treatments for the mental disease Alzheimer's and how it could theoretically be used to not only prevent the onset of Alzheimer's in patients, but also be used to help repair damaged neurons and mental connections. Fortunately, it turns out this prediction was more than accurate. In recent months it's emerged that a new form of treatment to assist with the treatment of Alzheimer's has come through, and it could potentially even reverse the negative effects of the disease. Questions surrounding the human consciousness could very well easily be one of the biggest questions in the universe for humanity. What exactly makes us conscious? What separates us a living entity with a non-living entity? What allows us to grow? To change to think and to plan around the environment and the universe itself? These are the questions that have plagued humanity since it first became conscious and self-aware. What is life? Of course it's pretty impossible for us to know and to truly understand the mechanisms of human consciousness. The human brain is so incredibly complex that it could take hundreds if not thousands of years even at the rate of technological innovation, before we even get close to understanding the capacity and causes behind every function of human consciousness. In fact, some scientists think that it may even be nothing more than misinformation, and that human consciousness is not real, but rather an interpretation of ourselves outside of purely physical phenomena. In this abstract, we could merely be falsely believing we are conscious, but secretly have no free will and everything inside our minds could merely be a product of our universe at the beginning of its conception. So my question to you guys is what do you make of this? What do you think life is? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.